so first we started with the line chart, different types of charts, where line chart is considering only the closing price. It gives just a visual representation how the daily activity has taken place. Its number is, its chart is better than simply telling the number K aaj close 2423 mein hua, din pe 2210 mein gaya, then 2356. If we simply tell the number, it's very difficult to have a clear picture about the scripts price movement. But in place of that one, if we use the line chart, it gives a clear picture. Earlier, all those advanced stuffs are not there. I'm talking about 100 years ago or uh, prior to that one. So even line chart was considered as the most advanced thing for them. Then came your bar charts. Till the candle chart became popular in the Western world after Steve Nishan brought this candle chart uh, concept to the West from the Japan. Prior to that, bar chart was the most advanced after the line chart. It is a three dimen uh, two dimensional um, picture where that gives a open kidar hua, low kidar hua, close higher hua, yeah, all these things. Then comes the candle chart. It gives the three dimensional visual impact. Jaha pe our perception or our visualization about the movement gives a great, means bigger clarity. Jaha pe humne last discuss kiya ki different components. Kya components hai? There are four components to a candle chart. What are the components? One is open, morning, market job open hua, is level pe hua, then close, market job close hua, 3.30 pe in our Indian market. So market kaha pe close diya? During the day, high kitna mara and low kitna, kitna din mara, kaha pe mara. Considering these four factors, we Try to visualize the price movement. Now, here, close is here, open is here, low, niche, high, open. But suppose in a candle, high and low is same. Sorry, high and close is same. High and close is same. So here it is with the close and here also it is the high. What it means? Market closed on that day at the day's high. Clear? Next comes, suppose high is there, but open and low are same. Open and low are the same. Yani, no pandra pe market jaha pe open hua, uske niche or price gya hi nahi, directly open. So it will be like this. So technically, there are four components, but it is not necessary ki kabhi high rehega, kabhi nahi rehega, jab nahi rehega, high and close is same, kabhi low nahi rehega, in such a case, open and low is same. Whether it is the bull candle or for the beer candle, red candle or the green candle, calculation or the assumption is same. Now, I come to a different chart for, now this, each candle, each candle, here you see, this candle low is not there. Low is not there. 
that means what open is equal to low then price closed moved higher little bit of higher weeks are there that means it traded high of 527.40 but finally closed little lower than the high days i at 525.90 it is there on the higher part yes abhi kya hoga uska yahan pe here open and high is same क्लोज लोअर एंड लिटिल वीक इज देर यानी क्या हुआ जब ओपन हुआ वहीं से सेलर स्टार्टेड डंपिंग बेचो 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 माल को बेचो यानी उसको ओपन की ओपनिंग लेवल से ऊपर जाने नहीं दिया दिस पर्टिकुलर कैंडल यानी जनरली कैंडल्स में हायर वीक्स भी रह सकता है लोअर वीक्स भी रह सकता है बट एट टाइम्स इधर हायर वीक्स नहीं रहेगा या लोअर वीक्स नहीं रहेगा और कभी कभी open and low same close and high same it will be in such a case it will be like this na upper risk rahega na lower risk rahega what it indicates ki upar jahan pe close diya wahi high hai jahan pe open hua wahi pe low hai that much only now ye ho gaya daily अभी आते हैं सपोज लास्ट कैंडल को लेते हैं क्या एक्टिविटी हुआ है ये पूरा का पूरा दिन का कैंडल है एक्टिविटीज है फ्राइडे का ओपन हुआ आपका 569.45 पे ट्रेडेड लो ऑफ 568.25 हाई ऑफ 577.50 एंड क्लोज्ड एट 573.60 इफ आई जस्ट टेल द नंबर दिमाग में कुछ फंसेगा नहीं but if i show you this picture you will automatically tell ki open yaha pe hua low yaha pe mara high yaha pe tha and close yaha pe hua information clear okay abhi isi daily chart ko if i break it into say 15 15 minutes chart yahan pe 16 june jo aapka i'll just sbi I am keeping two charts parallelly. Right part is the daily chart. Where the activity is this same activity here, but it is the fifteen minute representations. Time frame changes, candle ka structure change ho jata hai. Abhi yaha pe ab dekho ye pehla fifteen minute ka candle hai, then second fifteen minute, third. जो तीन कैंडल हुआ पहले का जो तीन कैंडल ये तीन कैंडल पांच पांच मिनट का तीन कैंडल को अगर हम सुपर इम्पोज करेंगे तो एक पंद्रह मिनट का कैंडल आएगा फिर सेकंड सेट ऑफ पंद्रह पंद्रह मिनट का तीन कैंडल को हम सुपर इम्पोज करेंगे तो सेकंड फिफ्टीन मिनट कैंडल आएगा देन एंड सो ऑन सिमिलरली दो पंद्रह मिनट का कैंडल को हम अगर सुपर इम्पोज करेंगे तो 30 मिनट से एक्टिविटी आएगा यस 
यहाँ पे दिस टू फिफ्टीन मिनट कैंडल्स दो कैंडल का इंफॉर्मेशन है पहला कैंडल का इंफॉर्मेशन क्या था ओपन यहाँ पे हुआ लो यहाँ तक मारा हाई यहाँ तक मारा क्लोज यहाँ पे हुआ क्लियर नेक्स्ट पंद्रह मिनट में क्या हुआ ओपन यहाँ पे हुआ लो फाइव सेवेंटी वन पॉइंट फिफ्टी थोड़ा सा नीचे तक लो आया फिर हाई यहाँ तक मारा फिर क्लोज दिया दो पंद्रह मिनट का इंफॉर्मेशन इस दो पंद्रह मिनट के इंफॉर्मेशन का अगर हम क्लाप करेंगे तो ये कैंडल बनेगा सिमिलरली नेक्स्ट दो कैंडल को पकड़ेंगे तो ये कैंडल बनेगा एंड सो ऑन ये थर्टी मिनट्स का बना है इस थर्टी मिनट्स को अगर क्लाप करेंगे दो दो करके तो आपका ऐसा कैंडल आएगा ये थर्टी मिनट एक कैंडल सेकेंड कैंडल वही इंफॉर्मेशन उसको फिर सुपर इम्पोज करेंगे तो ये कैंडल आएगा एक एक घंटे का उसी एक एक घंटे का पूरा का पूरा एक्टिविटी को इस सिंगल कैंडल में मार्च किया हुआ मींस ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन नाउ हाउ मच इंफॉर्मेशन यू नीड इज टोटली डिपेंड्स ऑन यू आपको कितना इंटरडे में खेलना है तो पांच मिनट में तीन मिनट में पंद्रह मिनट में खेलना है स्विंग खेलना है तो आवरली कैंडल या थर्टी मिनट्स का कैंडल पे खेलना है एंड मींस मीडियम टर्म में खेलना है तो डेली चार्ट में खेलना है लॉन्ग टर्म खेलना है तो वीकली या मंथली चैनल पे खेलना है सो हेयर वट इट इज इट्स जस्ट द टाइम फ्रेम रेस्ट आर सेम depending on the time frame how much information it is capturing that is what i want to means uh, mention it here ye 5 5 minute so the, uh, sorry to interrupt it's like mane uh, the moment time changes candle also changes exactly 5 minute candle captures only this much activity and your 1 hour candle captures this much activity यहाँ तक पांच पांच मिनट का इतना सारा कैंडल मिला के एक घंटे का ही कैंडल जस्ट लाइक आप कौन सा टाइम फ्रेम में उसको ट्रेड करना चाहते हो decision making depending on that one we can boil down but what i want to mean is candle is remain the same only the information changes depending on the time uh, period you are concerned theek hai sir so now if i Say this candle. What you see here, open higher, close lower, or open lower, close higher. Second one, red one. It open uh, higher. I think close lower. That is why it is a bearish candle or a selling candle. And here it is a green candle, open lower and close higher. Here it is a small body candle, depending on the size. the different types of names are coming to the candles we will not go each and every type of candles because we will consider only certain number of candles that we can consider for our study purpose kitna zaruri hai utna hi means suppose if we are, if we are going to a restaurant with four members We will order according to only the four members, not the entire hotel's uh, menu. We will not. We are not going to order. Similarly, here, jitna jorurat parega utna hi we are going to uh, consider. Otherwise, it's a vast, huge ocean. So, the basics of the candle. And what sort of information you are getting? from here this basics is clear to you
Sarah, I didn't get you. What of us means the basic candle? What is candle? What is line chart? What is bar chart? Whether the concept, basic fundamental concept is clear to you now? Yes, yes, yes very much. Right. Uh, should I uh, proceed further or keep it up to this only? Then the next topic will consider support, resistance, and all these things. Before support and resistance, we will go to different types of classification of candles. We will go. What are the different candles classifications? We will do in tomorrow. Plus different types of candles. And we will try to understand different combination of candles. Two candle combinations and multiple candle combinations on different types of that will give you the chart patterns, candle patterns. Thereafter, we'll come to support and resistances. Only depending on the your uh, candle chart. Then gradually we'll come to the indicators. There are different types of indicators, like your Here it is not that much clearly available. Suppose here, different means innumerable number of indicators are available, but we are not going to use that much. We'll use only selected few, five to seven. Okay, <laughs> see, so many. My goodness. Oh, my. So we'll it end up spending the uh, entire year, but I don't think it will finish so many types of indicators. So, just like what I want to mean is that suppose you are going to a restaurant, so many different menus are there from Indian to Chinese to Thai to continental, pizza, pasta, everything is there. But what you want to have, you cannot have everything. Yes, very true. So we'll restrict ourselves to as minimal as possible. And uh, we'll try to understand uh, line chart, uh, uh, this uh, moving averages, what is moving averages, what is RSI, what is Bollinger Band, what is V-Wave, uh, all these means a few, maybe five to seven indicators we'll study, how to use them and to take trading decisions. But that is the last part. Prior to that, we'll study the different candle progressions, different types of candles. Then your candle patterns, single candle patterns, double candle patterns, and multiple candle patterns. Then we'll go to the support and resistance, depending on the price action. Then also support and resistance using the moving averages and other stuff. Then we'll go to the indicator part. Any, whenever we are discussing anything, if any simplest doubt is there, you should ask and clarify it. If I know, definitely I'll tell. It is not necessary sure. that I will know everything. I know only if something, not everything. So, Yes, I know this, and this is the thing. If I don't know, then I will also to refer to some Google Baba and understand it. But, but basic things, I know that I can clarify that one. Ultimately, all this process, what is the need? Need is to take a trading decision. True, true. Trading decisions, we can buy or sell or sit in the sideways, what we to do, what we to do, all these things. So, for today, tomorrow we will go with, uh, come with uh, candle progressions. Okay? Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.